afternoon, everybody. Uh, welcome to Crabs on the Beach. My name is John Flanningham. I'm one of the uh, chefs here at Crabs. Uh, I'm very fortunate. I've been uh, cooking here on the Gulf Coast for over 35 years. And uh, we have some of the best red snapper. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to do a snapper cutting demonstration to show you how to get the best out of your fish. And since we've got this, our special, of course, you saw when you came in, the specials for today, fresh red snap. This is going to show you exactly how fresh the red snapper is. As I said, we try to utilize every little piece of the fish. Now look at this one. <laughs> it's even still got the hook. And it appears as if they were using some sort of mackerel. That appears what type of fish they were using to catch the snapper. So all your fishermen, if you want to know what they were using, they were using mackerel. And, and you can also see on the, the, the freshness of the fish, you see how red fresh the, the gills look. Like say how firm the touch, nice shiny bright eyes. That's that's always what you want. And of course, if it doesn't smell like fish, you know it's fresh. <laughs> Our watch really good. <laughs> <laughs> like I say, if you if you don't like the, the red snapper, we have uh, fresh hand cut steaks, uh, both New York strip, uh, ribeye, and of course we have all the crabs. We have the uh, the Dungeness the snow, the king, and of course we have fresh local blue crabs. We have a guy out of Bernito that brings us fresh local blue crabs. And uh, if, you, if you've ever tangled with those, that is one of the best things you can ever do in your life. If you've never had them, you need to try them. And our little bit of extra work, which are, like I said, you get, you get what you pay for on that one. Because it's so much fun eating them, picking through the bones and all, because they said the sweeter the meat, the closer to the bone. I've got, I've got a couple of them up here. What I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and uh, skin these and then let them take them back to the kitchen. And go ahead and start uh, uh, portioning them. You know, your portion is about an eight ounce portion, half a pound. So you get a nice, a nice, nice healthy sized portion of snapper. Let me see, I'll go ahead and clear just a little bit of this blood. And this, this is the funny, fun part. Uh, what it is, there's a, actually a piece of fat in between the, uh, the, the skin of the snapper and the flesh of the meat. And as long, once you hit that fat line, I just sort of pull the skin and push the knife. And the blade, like I say that sharp blade once again, it does the work for me. I have a beautiful snapper fillet and I have almost nothing left on this, on this hide. And uh, these hides, they actually sometimes they'll, uh, they can cure these and turn them into belts, uh, boots, jackets. Very expensive process, but I can imagine catching your own jacket or <laughs> even a pair of boots. <laughs> there's, 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 see how, how I did that, I'm going to show you that, that bone piece, how I was able to take that bone, roll it right across those bones, that gave me that little extra piece of meat right there. And that little part that I did right on the top of the head gave me that extra piece of meat, probably about two ounces. So it's, it's a real good technique to learn how. And there's, there's probably just a, two or three little bones right here in the back. And I'm just going to cut that, cut those off because we all want to know a, it's a fillet of snapper, which means no bones. And there we have a beautiful fillet of red snapper. I'll go ahead and skin the rest of these. Now i got a couple more of those other fish to cut. I just like having to doing a demonstration out here because, like I said, let you know how fresh the red snapper is. And plus, uh, who would argue with having to work at a place like this <laughs> where the gulf is my backdrop? <laughs> it's not really work. It's like I'm on vacation every day. <laughs> 